Besides winning Britain's Got Talent last year, this London musician has produced an album and been on tour. Tokyo Myers is the Breakthrough Artist of the Year at the first Classic Brit Awards for five years. His classical training underpins his fresh sounds and has gained new fans for old music. Now they've, you know, discovering new artists like Debussy, Rachmaninoff, Chopin, List, whatever it is. Um, and I think that's great, you know. Um, music is for everyone. Music is for everyone. So, uh, you know, just to... Uh, it's, it's great to be able to, to, to play my part in, you know, spreading the, the fun. Across town, the classical music stars of the future, perhaps. St Paul's Way Trust School in Mile End has a dedicated bunch of young musicians taking inspiration from different sources. You can't have any other music without classical, so any type of music that's popular has hints of classical in it. Piano music is everywhere, it's in pop, it's in country music, and I usually listen to it when I'm doing homework. Some people might look at music and be like, oh, this isn't really going to help me with my maths or literacy, but it really does. I find Yo-Yo Ma, like, his story, like, how he came to be a cellist is just really interesting. It's, it's just everything to me now. But fewer students are doing music at schools, in part due to lack of funding and pressure to take other subjects. Here we're very, very lucky to have the support of senior leaders in the community. It helps them in terms of discipline. Um, helps them in terms of commitment, social skills, um, let alone the cognitive development of actually reading notation and playing an instrument. So the influence of artists like Tokyo Myers performing at places such as the Royal Albert Hall Let's have a little look. This is where you'll be tomorrow. There we go. Has never been so important to continue the surge of enthusiasm for classical music among young people across the capital. Wendy Howell, BBC London News.